Hey everyone, welcome back to another CodeHS Python tutorial. In this lesson, we're tackling challenge 3.9.7, Kids Shapes Toy, a fun project where we'll create a colorful toy board using Python and geometry. Before we start, make sure you're watching this video in 1080p for the best experience. Click the gear icon, select quality, and choose 1080p. If you need subtitles, turn on closed captions by clicking the CC button. To change the language, go to the gear icon, select subtitles, and pick your preferred language. Si prefieres subtítulos en español, haz clic en el botón CC y selecciona español en el menú de configuración. Now, let's jump in. Overview. Your goal in this assignment is to draw a classic toy that teaches kids about shapes and colors. You'll draw four different colored shapes on a tan background using the circle command and extended parameters. Here's what the toy should include. A red square, a blue circle, a yellow semicircle, a green pentagon, and a tan background. These shapes need to be arranged in a square formation centered on the canvas with each having a radius of 60 pixels. Step one, set the background and speed. Start your program with these setup commands to make Tracy draw faster and to set the canvas color. In the editor window, type the following commands, speed zero, which will set the rendering speed to the fastest setting. Decolor open parenthesis, tan close parenthesis number, sign this command, will set the background color to tan. Step two, define the shape functions. We'll create a function for each shape. This keeps your code clean, readable, and easy to test. The first shape function we will define will be for the red square. Use the circle command with four sides to simulate a square. Def red square will begin the defining of the function then we will begin fill the begin fill command in python's turtle graphics used in code hs with tracy the turtle is used to start filling in a shape with color it works together with end fill to create solid filled in shapes instead of just outlines color red Circle, 60, 360, 4, and fill. The second shape function we will define will be for the blue circle. No extended parameters needed for this shape because it is just a circle. Def blue circle defines the function. Begin fill again. This command initiates the procedure to fill the shape with color. Color, blue. This command lets the editor know what color to fill the shape with. Circle open parenthesis, 60. Close parenthesis, pound draw, the circle at 60 pixels, and end fill. Let's the editor know that the process to fill the shape is done. Next, we will define the function for the yellow semicircle. For this function, we will use the command circle, open parenthesis, 60 comma, 180, close parenthesis, to draw a half circle 60 pixels. Then the 180 parameter will close the shape with straight lines. Def yellow, semicircle, begin fill, color yellow. Circle 60, 180, left 90, Forward, 120. Left, 90. End, fill. Finally, we will define the green pentagon function. A pentagon has five sides, so use that in the circle function. Def green pentagon, begin fill, color, green. Circle 60, 360, five. This command creates a circle and then the parameters will set the circle to 60 pixels 
and 360 degrees, and the last five parameters sets the sides to five, creating a pentagon. End fill. Step three, position the shapes. Now that your shape functions are ready, use set position and pen up to move Tracy before drawing each one. Pen up, set position, negative 100, 50 thermometers. We'll place Tracy in the top left corner. Then we will call the red square function that we defined earlier. Red square, we will now move Tracy to the top right corner. Pen up, we'll lift the pen up then. Set position, 150. We'll set Tracy in the top right. Blue circle runs the blue circle function that we defined earlier. We're next, we will create the yellow semicircle by moving Tracy to the right position using the following commands. Pen up, set position, negative 125, negative 150. We'll move Tracy to the bottom left. Then we will call the yellow semicircle function. Yellow semicircle. Next, we will need to move Tracy to the position to create the green pentagon. Pen up, set position, 100, negative, 150, moves Tracy to the bottom right corner. Green pentagon calls the green pentagon function we defined earlier. Go ahead and run the program and check for errors. If you followed along, your program should run great. Here are some final reminders. One, use pen up before you move Tracy with set position to avoid drawing extra lines. If you see unwanted lines, check your pen state and each shape should be centered to form a square pattern around the middle of the canvas. Now, the recap kids. In this lesson, you used extended parameters of the circle command to draw a square, semicircle, and pentagon. Practiced using functions to keep your code modular. Learned to position shapes accurately with set position and a little geometry. Created a fun and colorful project that reinforces shape recognition and coordinate plotting. Nice work. When you're done, run your program and review your shapes. Tweak their positions if necessary, and don't forget to save and submit your work. If you found this helpful, give it a thumbs up, share it with a classmate, and check out the next tutorial for more Python fun. Keep coding, and I'll see you next time.